Well, coming up next Sunday, it is the Minnesota Meritage event put on by Athletes for Animals. David and Kelly Backus are both here to talk about that. Great to have you both here. Thank you for coming in. Thanks for having us. And we have some adorable puppies. First, tell me who we have here today. This is Gimli, and he <laughs> is a sweet little pup that's available for adoption through Secondhand Hounds, and he's a part of their neonatal program. And this is Lafayette, who is uh, also available for adoption. And uh, yeah, these little guys were, were tube fed because their mother, uh, they got, they were born with cleft palate, so they yeah. weren't able to create suction, get milk the way we normally do yeah. for our mothers. Yeah. T tell me about Athletes for Animals. David, you and I were in Sochi uh, back in 2014, and there was a dog problem. They, and, and I know that at that time you had taken some back with you, but you started the foundation before that. Why is this so near and dear to your heart? Yeah, we started, you know, doing the layman's work of walking dogs and cleaning litter boxes at shelters. And uh, the people that were running the shelter said we could have a bigger impact if we just used our name and our platform and used the hours we were spending there to promote the work that was being done and show up at events that were raising funds for the shelter. So we kind of learned that the, the slow way and we want to accelerate that learning curve for other athletes by pairing up with them and raising funds and granting those funds yeah. to shelters that need it that are doing the great work like the work that's been done with these little pups. Yeah, really providing a voice for the voiceless. Yeah. Tell me about the event next weekend. What, how, I know you're excited about this. We were talking about a little bit off camera. Yes, yeah, so our Minnesota Meritage, it's for the wine connoisseur, sports fans, people who love animals, come out. It's going to be a really fun evening. We've got some fabulous things going on that night. We'll have athletes on stage and they'll be um, raffling off jerseys off their backs. They'll be on stage with animals from local rescue groups, a lot of great wine and food, some entertainment, a local musician mm -hmm. will be there playing. A really fun night. Very cool. Uh, you, of course, uh, just finished up your season uh, with the Boston Bruins this year, and, and you have such great names involved in this. Kind of, Can you give us an idea of who's going to be at the event next week? Well, Minnesota Wild players like yep. Zach Parisi and Jason Zucker, uh, former Wild players, and Nate Prosser and Ryan Carter, uh, and a bunch of other high-profile names like uh, Ryan McDonough, Drew Stafford. Um, Derek Stefan, who actually yeah. adopted one of the dogs that we saved from Sochi. That's awesome. So him and his wife will be there as well. So the money that you guys raise, how, where does it go back to and how does it help? 100% of all the money that comes in through our organization goes back out in the form of grants to groups like Secondhand Hounds, Top Dog Foundation. Many of the groups that will be there the night of our event have uh, been grant recipients. So we want to help out with spay and neuter initiatives, forward thinking programs, and great um, community projects that they're all doing. It's always nice when we see athletes and spouses who use their, their platform for good. Um, what what propels you to keep doing this? I mean, what, what is it that kind of keeps you going with this? Well, I think it's there's a little bit of an addiction that when you help a, an animal, you get that high, that yeah. they call it a rescuer's high, of seeing the situation the animal was in to the situation it's now in with a forever home. And that's a, a special feeling. And uh, we've always believed, uh, you know, with our faith that too much is given, much is required. And uh, we feel we've been given plenty and we need to, to help others and especially those that are voiceless like these four-legged friends of ours. Well, thank you both for coming in. Good luck with the event. If you want information, it is next Sunday, by the way, the 18th, and uh, we will have the information on our website, care11.com. Thank you both for coming in. Thanks for having us, Dave.